when the pandemic struck, I, I mean, my book came out a few months before the pandemic. And so for, from a, from a, from, for someone like me who like, who loves to observe and like whether this stuff is true or not, you know, you sort of go, <gasps> you know, you sort of wonder, is everything going to hold up or not? Uh, and as an existential flex uh, is something that I predicted would happen either zero once or at the absolute most twice in a career. But when COVID happened, we all went through it at the same time. Existential flexibility is, is that you're able to make a profound uh, 180 degree strategic shift in order to continue to advance your cause. In other words, stay relevant. Um, uh, this is not about the daily flexibility of business. This is, we're talking profound strategic shift here. Um, and sometimes brought on by pandemic, sometimes brought on by changing technology or politics or culture or tastes, um, but you're able to adjust. Um, so for example, it's um, Apple, Steve Jobs, when they're developing technology in one direction, they dis and they discover this thing called the graphic user interface that they did not invent. And they decide to walk away from millions of dollars spent and, and countless man hours in order to focus on a different uh, strategic uh, position because Jobs believed that that was a better way to advance his cause of empowering individuals to use uh, personal computers. Um, that's, that's existential flex. 